Construction is underway on a hurricane shelter in the community of Layu. This is the first of several modern regional shelters which the DLP administration intends to construct in strategic locations across the island. Funding has already been sourced for two of these structures. We have already secured funding from the European Union and as Minister of Finance, I will advise the Cabinet to assign some of the funds uh, to go towards the construction of um, dedicated hurricane shelters. And um, we have under the European um, Union funding two such shelters. Uh, they will have the same kind of features. It will be a multi-purpose facility, uh, but primarily focusing during the hurricane season and other times uh, for the safety of residents and shelter them. Because while what you want to do as far as practically possible, obviously we will not be able to have a facility like that in every village in Dominica, but we could have regional centers the $2.4 million emergency shelter or resource center in Layu supports the Prime Minister's vision to enable Dominica to become the first climate resilient country in the world. I think this structure uh, is a symbol of what we speak about when we talk about resilience and, and ensuring that whatever we do going forward as a country, that we can, those structures can withstand the elements, the, the, the ferociousness of the, of the winds and the hurricanes, uh, which um, we are exposed to from time to time. Parliamentary representative for the St. Joseph constituency, Honorable Kelva Daru, says the idea of an emergency shelter for the residents of Layu stemmed back from the collapse of the Matier Dam. And it just shows the compassion of this Labour Party government. And at that point in time, too, we made a commitment to the people of Layu that we would provide them with a uh, a shelter that will be adequately suitable for ensuring their safety both during and after a disaster. Lassa Charles is chairman of the Layu Improvement Committee as well as shelter manager for the Layu area. Today I must say I'm very much happy to see um, the level of um, progress we have made in this in the shelter. Um, the people of Layu we are very excited um, we can't wait to utilize the building. We already have already we have already started putting um, plans together, and um, since this one is the first of its kind, you know we, we, we really want to thank the government for giving us such um, a facility. Disaster preparedness coordinator Fitzroy Pascal is looking forward to the completion of this and other regional shelters across Dominica. The ODM is pleased to see the soon to be completed um, Layo emergency shelter and like the Honorable Prime Minister says plans are afoot to have two more of these specially constructed um, buildings in other parts of Dominica and more to follow as you know disaster management is about saving lives and property and reducing the disruption to normal life activity and this structure will surely bring comfort to the residents of Layu and communities uh, closer around during and after an event. The construction of regional hurricane shelters will aid the shelter subcommittee of the National Emergency Planning Organization, NEPO, to effectively shelter nationals in the event of a pending storm or other disasters. Glenroy Tuse is chairman of the shelter subcommittee of NEPO. If we go back to Hurricane Maria, in fact, 40% of our shelters were impacted, either destroyed severely damaged and so it means therefore we had a tremendous challenge as far as shelter management is concerned in Dominica. Um, of course for the 2018 hurricane season we had to call on the general public to develop what we call a neighborhood approach for families to take in families and friends and loved ones because of the challenge that we have. I am very very pleased on behalf of the NIPO subcommittee to thanks, congratulate and thank the Honorable Prime Minister and his cabinet for taking these initiatives to ensure that there is a safe and sound emergency shelters in several regions in Dominica. The Layu Shelter Project is expected to be completed by the end of June 2019. I'm pleased to announce that we are trying our best to complete that project as of the end of June, which we have in our contract. So we have increased our workforce. We have doubled. Are we working late hours to make it happen? So 
I'm pleased to say that we are, we, the Royce Real Estate and Construction team, are working tirelessly to make a name for ourselves and to make the government of Dominica proud. Daryl Tip for the Government Information Service.